I'm going to share with you now how we can do the handshake problem, even if we couldn't be together in the classroom. I could do a diagram for you. I've selected eight different students here, and I'm going to start with the first young man, and I'm going to show you how I could have him shake hands with everyone else, just by diagramming. I'm going to say that this young man shook hands with one, two, three, four, five, six, seven people. That is seven handshakes. And using a different color, I'm going to have this young lady start and she shakes hands with one, two, three, four, five, six. And so that's six handshakes. And now both of the first two people are finished. Using a different color marker, I'm going to start with the third young lady and she's going to shake hands with one, two, three, four, five. And that's five handshakes. And then we're going to go to the fourth person, the little boy in the green shorts, and he's going to shake hands with one, two, three, four. Now, students, I hope at this point we are seeing a pattern. And then we're going to have the young lady in the blue pants shake hands with one, two, three people that are left. And then, of course, we're going to have the little boy in the striped shirt shake hands with one, two people. And that leaves us with two people on left over. And they are going to shake hands with each other. And that's one handshake. Now, if we think back to our question, which I stressed to you before, it asked for the total. So, 7 plus 6 is 13, plus 5 is 18, plus 4 is 22, plus 3 is 25, plus 2 is 27, and 1 is 28. We have 28 total handshakes. And that's how you do a diagram or demonstration of solving problem solving on the smartboard. I hope you enjoyed the lesson.